Okay, I decided to do comparison between the cylinder heads. Here I've got the uh, 06 cylinder head and 08 cylinder head. So this is a second generation, 2006 and 2007 Kawasaki ZX-10R. And this is a third generation, 2008, 2009, 2010. So, first, let's start with the uh, exterior. They look pretty much the same, except for the markings. Uh, the 2006 cylinder head has a B marked between uh, intake port number 3 and intake port number 4. And 2008 cylinder head has a marking C. Between the uh, in the same spot between this uh, uh, intake port number three and intake port number four. So next, uh, let's move to the inside of the cylinder heads. As you can see, 2006 has a flat spot, and 2008 has improved oiling for the camshafts basically this piece goes right here if I can get it in there like so and the camshafts go inside of it So 2008 is definitely better than 2006. Then we're going to look at the uh, retainers. The 2006 retainers have big marks on the intake and the exhaust. And the 2008 cylinder head has retainers with uh, smaller marks on the intake and the exhaust. And 2006 has shitty retainers. They like to break just like this one. Here I pull the uh, retainers and I'll show you the difference between the two. You can see, let me put them right here side by side the 2008 is thicker than the 2006 one and that's exactly where it breaks so they fixed the issue in 2000 supposedly in 2007 but 2008s are definitely better Okay, another difference is that 2006 cylinder head has a gray kind of silver finish and the 2008 has black finish on the inside. So I'm not sure what that's all about, but you know, whatever. And uh, next, uh, let's look at the intake ports. So, uh, here I've got the 2006 head on the bottom and 2008 cylinder head on the, on the top. As you can see, the 2006 intake port is more round and 2008 intake port is more oval. So I went and uh, measured the intake port. What I came up with is that the 2006 intake port is 39 millimeters from here to here and 2008 is wider it's 41 millimeters from here to here so there's a two millimeter difference and uh, from top to, to bottom the 2006 cylinder head is 
34 millimeters tall and 2008 is uh, 32 millimeters tall so it's uh it's kind of funny how they made the port wider and shorter in 2008 so next uh, we're gonna go and look at the exhaust ports all right so I put the 2006 cylinder head on the bottom and 2008 on the on the top and for what I can see is that there's more material in the 2006 port than 2008 the port is actually bigger than the gasket Oops. so I can stick my finger in there and I can feel the edge of the port and the bottom is there's not a whole lot of material but if I look at the 2006 port you can actually see the port is actually smaller than the gasket and it actually matches pretty good at the very top and here you can see it against my finger you can see the port it's smaller than the gasket and the gaskets are the same so the 2008 port is bigger than 2006 port so uh, let's look at the uh, combustion chamber next all right so I've got the 2006 head right here and 2008 cylinder head right here and uh, you could see that this port that this combustion chamber is actually has less material here here is more aluminum and it's kind of shaved off on the 2006 head so the 2006 cylinder head has a bigger combustion chamber than 2008 cylinder head probably due to just having extra material so this combustion chamber is supposedly 21.2 cc's and this one's uh is uh 21 cc's so there's not a big difference but every small detail counts so i've got the 2008 intake exhaust valve intake a valve spring exhaust valve spring and uh the retainers and i've got the 2006 intake valve exhaust valve spring spring retainers so we already talked the different uh we already talked about the retainers that the uh, 2008 they're thicker than 2006 so let's see what the difference would be on the scale so 2008 retainer is 5 grams so I would think that 2006 retainer would be lighter so we've got 4 grams so there's a gram difference between the 2006 and 2008 valve retainers so next uh, we're gonna move into the, uh, the uh, valve springs so 2008 got the springs that's marked blue and 2006 has a green spring and it's they look pretty identical I'm not able to test to see if there's any difference in uh, seat pressure but if I had to guess I'd say they're probably the same and uh, the exhaust springs they're the same they're marked purple so if I had to guess they're uh, identical they didn't change them okay next uh, let's talk about the valves uh, the 08 intake valve 
Diameter is uh, 30 millimeters, and it's the same diameter as a uh, 06 intake valve. But there is a difference. For some reason, the 08 intake valve is actually it's a little bit thicker. So. We'll find out later why it's like that. Uh, the valve stems are the same on both valves, four and a half millimeters. And uh, let's see, the exhaust valve on the on the 08 head is actually smaller than the valve on the 06 cylinder head. The diameter of this valve is. Uh, 24 and a half millimeters and diameter on the 06 head is a uh, 25 and a half millimeters so not not big difference N not really a whole lot of difference you know the intake valves are the same size uh, oh and the valve stamps on the uh, 06 and the uh, 08 exhaust valves are the same too four and a half millimeters so I already measured them. So so far, uh, not much difference. O eight cylinder head has one millimeter smaller exhaust valve than the uh, O six. Fuck this sucks. Okay, next let's talk about the valves. First, we're going to compare the intake valves. Uh, the 08 uh, intake valve is uh, 30 millimeters in diameter, and the valve stem is 4.5 millimeters. Uh, the, 06 under, uh, uh, the 06 intake valve is the same size, 30 millimeters in diameter, and the same valve stem of uh, four and a half millimeters but 08 intake valve is actually thicker not by much but there is a difference so another difference is uh, I got a magnet right here and we'll find out if it's titanium or if it's stainless steel so here's the uh, 08 intake valve. Nothing, nothing, nothing. So that's titanium. Now let's take 06 intake valve. Whoops. That's definitely not titanium. So that's why I think there's a difference in the uh, size of the valves. So, so the exhaust valve on the 08 cylinder head is 24 millimeters in uh, diameter and the valve stem is 4.5 millimeters. The 06 exhaust valve is one millimeter bigger it's 25 and a half millimeters in diameter but the valve stem is the same so let's see if they're titanium or if they're not titanium well nothing so the 08 exhaust valve is not stainless steel. Let's see the exhaust valve on the uh, 06 head. Same thing. So we've got 08 cylinder head. Valves are both titanium and on the uh, 06 cylinder head the only one that's magnetic is the uh, intake valve. 
So that's something else that I didn't know before. It's, it's kind of odd. So let's see what the difference in weights. I'm sure this one's going to be the uh, 06 intake val valve. I'm sure it's going to be heavier than the rest. So first we're going to compare 08 intake valve. It's 18, 17 and a half grams. 08 intake valve, which is titanium. And we got 06 intake valve. 26 grams. That's a big difference. Okay, so next I'm going to weigh the 2008 exhaust valve, which is a... Um, Apparently made out of titanium and uh, it's 24 and a half millimeters in diameter. And it's uh, 13 grams. Now let's weigh the uh, 06 exhaust valve which is uh, 25 and a half millimeter in diameter. So it should weigh more. Okay, that looks like uh, 13 and a half grams. So it does weigh more. And uh, that pretty much covers the differences that I could tell between the two cylinder heads. But thanks for watching.